struck me that got me into Bernie was that a lot of his dances are really regional. And this is a really bipolar year. We've got obviously a huge amount of passion on both sides. And I feel like he's been in Congress so long, he's got decent relationships with our congressmen. He's a statesman. He's never yelling hate. And while he is obviously in disagreement with a lot of his colleagues, both on the Republican side and fellow Democrats, he still can keep reasonable. And Bernie has a passionate message, a clear message. And I feel like he generally wants to help people. I feel like that is his main thing. He's not in it for his own ego or his own <laughs> ambition, per se. He's in it because he wanted to help people. Well, I think we're in a really watershed year, and I think that a lot of people, tensions are running high, a lot of people feel like the way that things currently are isn't good enough. Like, we have made progress, but we need to keep moving forward. And so I feel like there's a lot of passion that was there to be tapped. But when you saw the passion that was there, and when people said, wait a minute, this guy is a little bit different. This guy is not running around talking about his own ego. This guy is not running around just giving you basic talking points. He has policy. He has years in Congress and in the Senate actually developing policy and working with building relationships with others there. And even though he is, he's a congressman, he's not, he's a senator, he's not someone who's outside the establishment. But he's kept his principles and his integrity. He's not someone that has no idea what he's doing. But he still has that passion and he still seems to really connect with the average person. There are plenty of Trump supporters who I'm sure are nice people. They're not all evil demons and they're not all you know racist bigots. Not all Bernie supporters are going to be you know, dyed-in-the-wool anarchists. Not all Hillary supporters are just supporting her because she's a woman. Not all Cruz supporters are crazy Christians. Every single faction. People have reasons for supporting the candidates they support. And I think that we need to actually listen to those reasons and have the conversation without so much rhetoric and so much infighting and so much vitriol. We need to be willing to build bridges and talk to each other.